So here we are, the very last day of school. In fact, school is over. Potluck is done, movie is done, students gone. I've cleaned everything up and I'm hoping that my camera does not tilt or fall. <laughs> anyway, I'm heading home. It's rained. It rained a bit last night. There was a storm, then it rained more this morning, and then I don't know what it's done since then. But I, it looks like it's going to rain. But it's warm now, so it's all good. Um, yeah, uh, I think we'll go home a different way. Uh, an adventurous way. <laughs> a really nice part of town way. Well, still between here and my house, you know, so I'm not going to go all over Hell's Half Acre for you guys. No. But we're going to explore a bit. So there's a big house. I don't know if you can see it. We're going this way. This is my regular way home. Regular way home. Normally, I would cross the street, the bridge at the bottom of the hill, bottom of the hill here, but I don't think I will. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm going a different way, sort of. Uh, probably one of my friends lives there, the lady that I know, and then other people that I do not know live there. I think I'm going to go left here. just because I can. Oh, I'm tired. It was great. Great movie. Great potluck. Um, everyone had a fantastic time. It was a small group, but as always, the summer school, uh, the students are really appreciative of what you've done and really realize what they've learned. And uh, I don't know, they're just they're just a different different type of student. More more intent on what they want. Especially the ones that come to the last day of classes. Especially them. Oh, I guess I should have gone. Okay, well I'll go right here. My regular way. Oh well. Right here. Right here. Okay. So again, the post office we're looking at now. And uh, we're still going to go right. So you're still going to see the old library, the former library which I saw last night on Murdoch Mysteries. That was so cool. It was actually the library in Toronto for Murdoch Mysteries. You, if you actually see Murdoch Mysteries, you'll recognize the, the doors of the library. So that's, that's kind of cool. Is the current library that you see there. Oh, buddy. 
right now, oh, well, I can't turn right here. Maybe that's one way. We will go straight. That's another church. You see that on my, on my uh, videos. Right here, so we can a side shot of the church. No, it's a really big deal. And then, oh, we can't go up that street. It's a do not enter street. Okay, well, that's a bummer. Oh, we'll go right. Freak, yeah, we'll go right. We'll go right here, because you can. I know you can't go through this, but we're going left here. Because people live here, you can go left here. Ugh. Yes, because this is an old and rich part of town, the largest percentage of millionaires in Canada or North America. I can't remember what it was a long time ago. Yes. It used to be that in this part of town, you had the largest percentage of millionaires. Of course, you can't see it because you're looking out to the right. But I will pull up because they have a vertical here. But you will come into this part of town, and all of a sudden the houses will start looking different. Oh, that's neat! I didn't know I realized. Wow, oh, they built that. Interesting. I haven't come to this part of uh, town recently. Yes, this is this is uh, an old. Uh, well off part of town and I'm going to go this way because I want you to see my favorite house. I really like this house. I really don't know why. It just suits my taste. Um, it's pretty. Speed bump. Actually speed hump. Because they're not very bumpy. I used to live in this part of town. <laughs> Can you believe it? I did. So now we're going to turn left. You're going to see a dark gray house with white posts and white. That, that house, I love that house. It's gone now. It was the dark gray house with, uh, with white shadows. Yes. Okay, uh, I'm not going to turn left here because our car is coming, so I'm going to turn left one street further. I just live back there. Yes. I lived in a rental unit back there on a back street on a lane. I used to hang out here. Yeah. Drove me crazy with jealousy. Yes. Indeed. So here we have Victoria Park coming up. I have to walk my kids to school here. Across this park. That's Victoria Park. There's Victoria Park in every city in Canada, I believe. Victoria Park. They actually play uh, cricket here every Sunday. There's a tennis club there, tennis courts, and a newer houses, older houses, you know, big houses, small houses. As I said, the, the they used to have the largest percentage of millionaires in Canada, I believe it was. Beautiful street lights here, they're all globes. Like globes. This house somebody used to own AMW here. A E franchise. <laughs> oh, they painted their house interesting. The next corner is a Plastic surgeon, and on and on and on. Oh, this house is for sale. Hmm. I know who used to own that. Hmm. So it's, it's a, you know, like I said, I never used to come here. I haven't come here in a long time because it, it just eventually drove me crazy with jealousy to live here because. We lost so much, and and these people have so much, and it was just a bad state of mind. 
man, when you're in that state of mind, you don't want to hang around with people who have so much money. But this is, you know, it's already getting cheaper here. All the rich ones are back there. Some of the rich ones. I mean, the ones that, you know, want to have those houses, of course. There, folks. Ooh, there's a fire engine. There's a fire engine. Fire station. Funeral home. Cook's funeral home. My mother's looking at there is, um, I believe, no, that's a for sale or lease building, but after that, across the street from that building that you see is uh, what we call Bucks, and it's uh, a large variety store that has been there for eons, and it used to look a whole lot different and be differently situated, but it's been rebuilt, and nice and new and it's a Sunoco station but it's still Buck's variety. The Buck. The Buck variety. The Buck. The Buck. And it's other things too. Uh, I think it's a uh, well, Bank of Montreal. No, a Royal Bank. And there's a dry cleaner there. But anyway. Our vet is on the left here across the street. Which is We're holding this freehand, you're right, I can show you this, but that would not be safe. So I don't do that. I would not be a safe driver. I've done it and I'm not safe. So this is the way I read it. This is our bank of Montreal, which is just a little hole in the wall. My short little street, ending up with my little dump of a house. But hey, we'll fix it up eventually. We are fixing it up slowly. Slowly. Okay. Oh, sign on the neighbor's lawn. Red something. Hmm. What are they doing? Uh, my house. That's it. My house. There we go. A different and more interesting way through home, through town. Glad you enjoyed it. Won't be doing that again for a little while. <laughs> one-time experience, folks. One-time experience. Did you want to see my pretty flowers? Well, I got some pretty, pretty roses from my students. So, here we have it. Have a good day.